if you actually bothered with my intro, you would have noticed something really different. Well, guess who's the new water type and you, gym leader of the Midnight Moon forums? Yup, I'm talking to you. That guy is talking to you. Anyway, the girl who is swimming is up against a uh, sea king and the only time i ever seen a sea king lead in my entire pokemon battling life is a uh, rain dance flail sash one so i just decided to go for the aqua tail to break that sash and out comes this thing it thunders me i was like what in the sweet hell tarnation and the girl who is swimming can't take electric shock so it kind of electrocutes and dies and floats in the sea mindlessly hoping for some Handsome bodyguard to come to her rescue. Anyway, I I just have the feeling that it's choice in some way, so I'm gonna send out my scrap ninja, my first wild card, because the gyms in the Midnight Moon League do allow two wild cards. And this is probably a good time to explain that no, he's not a challenger. I'm just testing my teams, and he just wanted an NU battle, so I just thought to myself, why the hell not? So, anyway, I forgot to name my Pion, Pion, I don't know how to pronounce that name. I just spread it and I was just eving, 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 and then I forgot to name it. I was like, oh, and I have such a genius name for it as well. So, his rock slide does a whole chunk. It does a lot more than I expected it to anyway. And I have to go for the rest now, hydration or not, because I'm, I, I want my, I want my Theon alive. Um, yeah, so I I didn't have the time to go for the rain dance because I got a crit, and I'm just gonna go for the quack draxis here, but turns out it, he's not choice, I mean, I, I didn't figure this out at all, because if he wasn't choice, he could have exited my Fion in the first place, I guess he was just predicting a switch to the scrap ninja, and then I died because of an exited crit, which totally mattered, but whatever. That, um thing dies to poison so yeah sacrifices have to be made and the great sacrifice is for a free glacial switch in and i don't want to stay in i don't know why i was i was fearing that thing might have fire blast because come on that thing is bizarre and it's a weird ass thing and well thankfully he just went for the thunder i don't know why he just didn't go for the bug step move so He's gonna think for quite a long time here, or maybe it's just Wi-Fi lagging, but I highly doubt it. So my Bender X Scissor doesn't do quite as much as I thought it would on the Luminion, so that thing must be defensive as bulky, and... I'm just gonna withdraw here because I know a Toxic is coming, and I didn't go to my Fion to take it for some reason. I, I just didn't feel so good about sending it in, because I know Fion is, in all honesty, a little bit cheap. Okay, fine, it's cheap. So... Well, let's just assume that I'm sending my Grace Glaze because I want some offense instead of instead of defense, and I have Hidden Power Grass. In fact, Hidden Power Grass is ought to do something, right? Well, it does around a third to a Mantine, a well-known special war in NU, which is which just proves my point. Glaceon is too awesome. So he goes for the Hydro Pump here, and I'm like, what? And thankfully, I can outspeed this Mantine because I've been outspeed my man by Mantines before. And my Hidden Power Grass is a 3 KO on the Mantine. I have just 3 KO'd a special wall with Hidden Power. That's a neutral. How many things can actually do that? Well, maybe that thing's more offensive because of Hydro Pump and stuff. But whatever. I'm just gonna go out to a Scrap Ninja because I have nothing better to go out to. And I was going for the trick here because I know he's gonna go for the Toxic. But there's this strange voice in my head that goes, Will always, Will always. And I'm like, Yes, Master, I will below Wisp. And thankfully that Toxic does miss and I can go out on my field and I actually get a burn off, which is nice, I guess. So I'm just gonna sit here and stall him out, even though that's a kind of, you know, morally wrong. But that's the best thing I can do at this point. So out comes a Slow King and I'm thinking, th okay, the only thing he can touch me with is a random Fire Blast and why the hell would he want to use it against a Fion? <laughs> So I'm just gonna go to my Scrap Ninja, and I'm just gonna go for the Hard Axe Scissor here, because, well, if he stays in, he'll pretty much die. If he switches out, that Luminon is pretty much dead. Sadwick kinda survives, even with the burn, and I'm like, argh. And I felt so bad for walling him and his entire team dead with my Scrap Ninja here, so I'm just gonna leave it in to die. And he dies to my Axe Scissor, and I'm gonna die to my Poison. So I'm just gonna go to my Mantine, because Mantine is so awesome. In fact, Mantine, the name is so wrong, because man is a word, and you can separate the man with the tine. Tine is another word for sharp object. So... <coughs> 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 
never mind. Anyway, that psychic did a whole lot, and I, in my mind, I was thinking that thing is so specs. Translation: I lose. <laughs> so, I set up my rain because I know my main tank can't do anything, and I forgot those things has own own tempo. Even though, well, you just you can just say that I was hoping it had oblivion instead. So I live with four, not that it matters, because my serve does absolutely nothing, even if I get, did get a crit, which I didn't, and he psychics me and I die. So that's a good game, Dustox King, and I got your name right, ha! Huh? Good game and goodbye. Hopefully I don't sound too off because I'm ill.